So, first example with the group stage. In this example, we will use just one group stage, no other stages. And here we will group by age field. In the aggregate request, we use just one group operator. Then comes colon and then key value pair. Key underscore id is mandatory. And value is a string with dollar sign age. This is an expression that refers to the age field of the input documents. Question. Which input documents are passed to this group stage? Answer is simple. Whole collection of persons is passed to the group stage. Because we don't have any other stages before group. So we will group all documents in the collection persons. And we will group them by age. What do we get as a result of operation? We get set of documents with exactly one field underscore id, here it is, and different values appear on the right side. Those values are distinct values of the age field of the documents in the person's collection. To summarize, we simply get all different person's ages, 27, 30 and so on. Please note that results are not sorted. We will talk about sort later on. Ok, let's move to the shell and play with this group operator. After previous example, we had aggregate request here with match stage. Let's replace match with a group. And here on the right side we need to use underscore id as a field name. And as a value we need to use expression. Recap that each expression must be embedded into the quotes. Then comes dollar sign and field name of the input documents. We can take any field name of our documents. Let's take for example gender. So simply dollar sign gender. So what will be the result? Let's execute this command enter. So just two documents. Underscore id is the field name of those documents. And here we have all possible distinct values of the gender field in input documents. And there are just two different options, male and female. Let's use another field here. For example, eye color. Command enter. And here we get three results. Brown, blue and green. So just three documents. Let's group by name. And here we get all possible person's names. Of course, we will get 1000 documents here. Because person name is unique. And as a last example, let's use age here. Command enter. And here we get all ages of the persons. So totally 21 result. Ok, let's go on. And in the next example, we will group by nested fields. See you in a second.